Yeah, first first ascendant. Uh, I can't really comment too much on the first ascendant stuff. I do have a couple buddies of mine, uh, Glad and Gathalion, who are absolutely loving it. But they're also the kind of gamers who like really, really enjoy farming. Content. So the 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 kind of takeaway that I've gotten from the first descendant is that if you really like to farm things, <laughs> it might be great for you. But if you're not really into like the repetitive farming, then it's not. It, 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 it's like Warframe. It's a farming game. Except from what I understand, uh, I have been told like the story in the world is, and stuff is a little more developed in Warframe. So, it, 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 I, First Descendant is like a very pretty loot grind free to play game. And some people love that stuff and more power to them. For me, I generally like to have a little bit more story or a little bit more to, to latch onto. That's one of the reasons, for instance, I only go back and play Warframe when they do the big story updates. Um, and I don't, I don't quite know if there's enough of that in First Descendant for me. But we'll see. It's another deviated saffron. Dude, awesome. Hey, quick question. And I and I asked this earlier, I think, but I didn't see the reply. Um, can we grow deviated plants in our farms? Yes. Oh, how cool. Okay. So we may just want to grow like a whole bunch of a crop specifically to get its deviated stuff. Cool. Okay. Rude. Hey, Spats, what's up, buddy? Uh, so... Hey, new to the stream was just browsing Twitch, and it's the first time I see this game. What is it about? Hi. So this is a free-to-play, uh, online adventure game. You could kind of say it's a looter shooter because of how much loot there is, but... It, it's not a looter shooter in the traditional, like, you get tons of different guns kind of thing. It's more looter shooter in that you just get a whole bunch of loot all over the place. Um, but really, it's a free-to-play kind of online adventure game. Uh, it is it is a lot of fun. It has base building, a kind of large MMORPG slash single-player style map to crawl through. There's some story, if you like that. <laughs> it, it still needs a little bit of work. But, yeah, overall, it's just it's a really fun free-to-play game that is one of the least if not the least pay to win of its of its level. And um, I played it in beta and now and I've had a great time with it. I've got a couple thoughts videos on my YouTube if you want a bit more in depth there. But yeah, I would say this game is like a, it's like an online multiplayer adventure. I, I still, I, looter shooter is the best thing I can think to call it. I'm sure there's a better term for it, but yeah. It's a lot of fun, though. It's good. I do want to warn people, though. Uh, I do want to warn folks that this game is undergoing a metamorphosis and we're not really sure where it's going to end up. So um, if you're like a casual player specifically, I would go to the Discord. I would look into their plans for what, what they call seasons. And I would see if that fits what you're looking for from the game. Yeah. It's more of a community survival builder than looter shooter. The thing that makes me the thing that makes me not call it a survival game is that it is that it has way more defined RPG mechanics. When you say survival, you think Valheim, Rust, uh, Forest, even like, and 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 those games are much more sandboxy. They have stories, but they're much more sandboxy. This one is like an MMORPG, you know, level one area, level three area, level five area, level ten area, level fifteen area. That's not really, that's. There is progression in survival maps, but this is much more gamified than normal. So it's it's kind of hard to call this a straight survival game because there's so many mechanics from other genres in it that it kind of transcends that. Yeah, it's it's more, I would call it more of like an RPG with survival aspects. Um, a third person RPG online survival shooter. Man, at this point, I don't, I don't even know what to call it. <laughs> like, oh my lord. It, 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 it does so much that it's kind of hard to shoehorn it into a single thing. Which is honestly one of the reasons I like it so much. To put it bluntly. Yeah, I think the fact that I find it so hard to define its genre. Oh, great! Is one of the reasons I like it so much. Ooh. Oh, man. Woo! Here we 
need that one. Yeah, for, for our power boost, or our power burst. Oh! <sighs> Electric furnace power consumption and crafting time minus 60. When crafting drones, turrets, shields, and generators increase their use count by one. Iced tree T effect duration 200 and potency 30. Furnace, sintered brick, and glass crafting time minus 50 and yield 100. I don't really need, I don't care about these because that's just gravel. So whatever. I don't know what tree at ice T is. I'd have to look into that. This could be good, but I don't really use any of those. And this I use all the time and could be awesome. I'm looking, I'm looking at efficiency lever. Um, yeah. Probably going to go ahead and get that one, I'm thinking. Let's go over here real quick. Oof. Nice little increase there. Enhance. Ah, needs more energy links. I need more money, chat. I need more money, buddy. Um, let's see. Helmet mods. Sure. Let's pop that in there. Face. Sure. Gloves. Dude, we're upping our damage so much right now. Um, this is kind of wild. Here we go. Um, sure, we'll put one more of those on. So now it's like an extra 40% damage, I think, about, almost. that one we don't have any crit rate ups do we hmm we'll, we'll pop one weak spot damage in there yeah crit rate seems to be rare okay but hey that's awesome we just got so many more good things here Okay, we gotta calibrate the heck out of this thing, but we'll do that in a little bit. Awesome. Gonna make some more ammo when we're back too. Can we get a little radar thing that tracks deviants on our minimap? Like deviant things? Is that a goat? Is that a level 43 goat? What the hell is this? Oh wait, I need to do this too. Um, I want the the short one. I want you. Let's go with the... Infrared. And you there. Perfect. Ah, much better. Is this still slated for release on mobile in September? I believe so, yeah. As far as I know, that is the plan. Oh, little baby. It's okay, little baby. I won't make you live all alone. What the hell is that? Uh. Is that Starcrom? Cool. That's a rare. Heck yeah, man. Why are we beeping?
Yo, these are a little out. Is this the next tier? I think I'm in the wrong area. <laughs> I'm in the wrong area, chat. Yeah, this is this is not where I should be. Okay. Hold on a sec. Um here we go. <clears throat> Excuse me. You don't need to have the electric drill in the action bar for it to work? Really? That's cool. Thank you. Uh, last child with the highlighted message earlier. At Co Carnage, make sure you use an axe and not the chainsaw for chance of deviant. Thanks. Uh, and then what's this? At Co Carnage, are you interested in getting a solar drill? I have an extra can trade for some stuff, maybe. Uh, what is a solar drill? Maybe. Sounds cool. But yeah, what what is what is a solar drill? Mm -mm. An upgraded electric one? Oh yes, I I would like a solar drill, please. Absolutely. I will take a solar drill if you have an extra, sir. I would love to trade you for one, if you wouldn't mind. Uh, let's put this on. Speaking of that, I am going to put up one of... I need a vending machine. <coughs> um, I gave a bunch of these away like a dingus. I should have been charging people for them. Uh, where is my vending machine? Mm -mm -mm. I guess I did trade a lot of people. Is it logistics? What else? Of course, I don't have enough for it. There's got to be something I can make that I can then sell. Let's see. Maybe we could just like harvest a bunch of a bunch of steel. Can I sell steel ingots? We should do that. Uh, I'm not going to make all those yet, actually. No, we're going to do one of those. Some glass. Wait. Make a vending machine? I can't yet. I need to, uh, I need to sell some things first. I can sell these for like 200 a pop. If I want to make a bunch of, I, I can make some alloy ones now. These may sell pretty well. We'll try some of those real quick. Which is good, because I gotta pee real fast. Chat, I will be right back. I'm gonna use the potty real fast, and then I'm going to play for another, like, five hours. So I'll be right back. Um, and for those that aren't aware, I have been streaming a lot lately uh, of this game, and not and not doing lunches. <laughs> uh, which means I'm very behind on my, my ads per hour. So I do need to run some ads whenever I go FK. I am sorry about that. Um, but hopefully, you'll all be back when I'm back. So... Back in a second. Sorry, non-subs. If we get a wall of good vibes for the non-subs, good vibes to you. I'll be back in one second. Ohio. Gozaimas. Not Ohio like what the kids say. That's totally different. All right, let's go see if these sell for anything. Actually, let's do another round first. Although, I really shouldn't be selling all of my alloy, because that means I'm basically selling my acid, which means I'm selling it and making a huge mistake. Where are all my nodes? Oh. Someone's harvesting my stuff. Hello? Uh, we'll let those finish, then we'll get out of here. Hey, can I find a second flame frog? You want to join to take it? Sure! Yeah, but I don't know what that is, Julia, but that sounds awesome. Hold on, let me get out of this group real quick. Want to shoot me an invite? We're going to need to find a good acid farm. I think acid farms are just going to kill the enemies, right? This it used to be. Alright, Julia. Are you over here? Okay. 
Do my, does my teleport thing work to teleport to you? Oh, I don't think so. Okay. Insufficient space in crate? What does that even mean? Mm -mm. You need to delete and remake your furnaces for the perk you picked? Oh, I haven't picked the perk yet. Yeah. Do we just go to World 3 first? Okay. We'll do. Do I want some silver... Uh, do I want some silver ingots? No, I'm good. Thank you. Thank you. No, I, I, I don't take handouts, uh, but I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Very nice of you. Okay. Let's see if this is actually going to work. Um, go here. Sure. Do I run 24-7 ads? Yes. All I do is run ads 24-7. That's all I do. That's how I, that's how I make my money. Nobody subs here. This, this is a... Uh, this is where this is where subs go to die. If you're really concerned about acid, you can make food that guarantees 50% more acid drops. What? Really? Okay. Well, we'll have to look into that. I wonder if food around major uh, cities can deviate. Hey, where do we get the little B deviation? Where's that little chungus? Fix your sanity? Yeah, my sanity's fine. I'm checking this real quick, then heading to Julia. Oh, wait, I gotta go to World 3 first. That's right, that's right, that's right. One day, beaver. One day. Today is not that day. But one day. One day. Let me get my sugar beets, and we're out of here. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. Do -do 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 -do. The bee drops from the morphic crates, or can be found near some farms. Oh, cool. Yeah, I have yet to see the bee. Oh. Ha! Hi, kitty. I get a better one? No, it's the same. Can we sell deviations? Can you trade them? That's a thing, right? It is a thing. Cool. I'm totally going to put that in my vending machine when I get that. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. All right, chat. Wish me luck. Oh, 200. What? They, they sell. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Those are my steals. Hold on. Hold on. 400. Okay. That's a little better. That's a little better. Okay. Most importantly, what that'll do is let us get our vending machine, which hopefully will make us some money. I, I think we'll see. We don't know. Uh, here we go. Okay. Great. And actually, let's go ahead and do this. I think I'm going to go ahead and do this the more I think about it. Let's do... We'll do the furnaces. Although, wait, what is iced treant tea? Can I, can I see that? Roll speed 25 and move speed 20 after rolling. Is that what would be better? Is 
Is that, is this? Oh, it's treat, not treant. There's iced treat tea, which I'm reading all wrong. Is So is that a different version of this or is that like a completely different thing? Maybe it's a five. Hmm. Someone may take. The oh, 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 Julia. Okay, hold on. I'm sorry. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Uh, three. Boop. Right. No? Okay. <laughs> I guess we're not using our bike. That's fine. What servers already have the second phase? I am not sure. Oh, I think it's out. Is that it? I've never seen that thing. Guys, why can't I summon my bike? going on here oh okay oh geez go go action motorcycle What is all this? Oh, this looks cool. I want to do this, but I can't because I got to get to Julia. Okay. Mm. 30 hours in and I just learned you can sell in this game. Oh, yeah. Oh, we have to do this area too. Cool. Oh. Oh, Julia, cool, thank you. Oh man. How fun, dude. What is this guy? I don't even know what this does. Increases production efficiency of the furnace and electric furnace. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you, Julia. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. You are the best. Boop. Ooh woo. Alright, let's go. Um, we have a quest over here? What is this? Go with Denzel and find a way to restart the production lines? Yeah, sure. Let's do this while we're here. Gives us some more stuff and we need stuff. Oh, those are all friends. Hi. Okay. Find and kill five deviants nearby. Okay. I can do that. Maybe. Hopefully. Go. Cool. Acid? Acid. Uno mas, uno mas. Perfect. All right, let's go talk to him. <clears throat> hey, Seraph, what's up, buddy? What level am I? I just hit 30. Just hit 
it's safe. Okay, let's hunker down. Go do these two things real quick. Okay. I can do these things real quick. I'm going to get that crate. For reasons. Hmm. Oh, hi. Oh, my. You are a beast. Give me your loot, sir! There it is. Oh, such good loot. Delicious loot. Excuse me. All right, how are we getting up there? Not this way. Can I pull up on one of these? Any ladders? Necesito ladder, por favor. go have some bread with jam bro drinking some foods eating some gummies you know how it is it's a good friday night uh let's do this right here there we go i don't want to hear about it word you oh it's only storage Man, I thought gold crates were gear and weapon. Rude. So wait, what do the colors of the crates mean? I thought blue was storage, gold was gear and weapon, and uh, the orange pink was mythic or mythical. Aren't they all gold? I don't think so. Some are blue. No, some are blue. Absolutely some are blue. Maybe it's just like a rarity thing. Like blue, gold, and pink? Maybe, maybe it's that simple. Gold crates have better loot. Okay. Find the main floor at the center of the chemical plant. Okay. Blue are resource only. Oh, okay. That would make sense because medical stuff counts as resource. That's why the medical ones are always resource. Yeah, okay. 